Wrightsville kids, I'm Pastor Julia. Today, I have a challenge for you. I have a special, special job for you and I wanna see how well you can do it. So, here's what I want you to do. While you're watching, I want you to walk in circles around whatever room you're in and I want you out loud to try to say the alphabet backwards. Okay, ready, set, go. Okay, now while you're doing that, I wanted to tell you the start of a Bible story. Once there were two women who Jesus was friends with named Mary and Martha, and Jesus decided to come over to their house and have dinner. Okay, how are you doing? How are we going? Okay, and stop. Now, do you remember the names of the two characters that I just told you about? I bet it's pretty hard to remember, isn't it? It's hard to listen when we're working really hard and trying to focus on doing something, isn't it? Well, let me tell you that story again because I think you'll understand it better now. Once Jesus went over to have dinner with two of his friends named Mary and Martha. And while he was over there, Martha was really, really worried. She was working really, really hard to make sure that Jesus had everything that he needed. She was in the kitchen and making all of the food and cleaning up and making sure everybody had everything that they needed. That seems like a really good thing, right? But she was getting so annoyed because her sister Mary wasn't helping at all. All Mary was doing was sitting down at Jesus' feet and listening while he talked. So finally, Martha got so annoyed that she came up to Jesus and said, Jesus, tell my sister Mary to help me. And you know what Jesus said? It's really surprising. He said, no, Martha, because Mary is doing the better thing. Jesus was more happy with Mary for sitting and spending time with him than with Martha for working so, so hard. You know, when we're working so, so hard and we're so busy, even if it's something really important like helping other people, sometimes we get so busy doing that that we forget to listen for God. And we miss out on time just to be with God and to remember how much God loves us. So this week, I want you to practice taking some time just to listen for God and to tell God how much you love him, because that is what's most important. Let's say a prayer together now. Will you repeat after me? Dear God, Thank you for making me. Thank you for loving me. Help me love you. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye.